What's the bra- the mainstream news? And so they have Let's other hear. entities in place, local law enforcement, state police. That they have one hundred and thirty nine thousand. So there people will be an assessment this. there. Did something happen there? It's going to be all these different layers. So the director is going to have to come in prepared and ready because they're definitely going to be asking very hard questions. Hard. Evie Pamporis, former Secret Service agent. Evie, we're glad to have your expertise here on a night like this uh, when there have been many fast-moving developments. And again, just to remind folks where we stand now, you are looking, of course, at that image. Uh, look at now they're seen doing nothing. The they're world, getting pushed the around by the fucking dudes. Raising yeah. his fist after having been shot by a bullet that he says pierced his right ear in an assassination attempt. The investigation ongoing. The suspected shooter dead, as is one other rally goer, one person who had simply showed up to this rally in Butler, Pennsylvania, to support former President Trump. Two other people. So Hassan and them are mad because they're saying that he's clip farming right there. But it's like, what do you, of, of course he's going to do that. Like, he knows what he's doing. He, he, that's a power move. It's yeah. the right thing to do. To well, not only that, his adrenaline you know? is probably going like crazy. Oh, for sure. Oh, yeah. big Definitely. time. Definitely. I love that they're finally putting an assassination attempt on there, too. So that before it was like loud noises or, or something at the rally, but now they're finally admitting that it was an assassination oh. attempt. Oh, and you I'm know, shocked how many female agents there are. There's a lot there's of them. three of them. Yeah, that's three more than the. Anyway. The funny thing is, is that's that if because you had a directive <laughs> to, to the increase image of when they're on the podium, three percent women. If you go back to the image of when they're on the podium and there's the one that's standing in front of him with her arms around the other uh, Secret Service agents. You can see Trump's head right over the top. Like, network and not even news now it. as well. It's so stupid. Oh, we're going to be DEI in Secret Service. Yeah. Jackson, we'll see you tomorrow. It's over. I guess that's it. You know that every single every single news establishment is going to have their journalists come into work at like five in the this morning tomorrow to figure out all kinds of. Fucking headlines that they can come up with. Oh, this to try to make this spin into a, uh, you know, a sympathy story for their side somehow. I love this. Oh, this was an assassination attempt. Like we needed confirmation. Yeah. yeah. Nowadays we do. It was some guy practicing on his firing range next door. You know that it was such an accident. Well, according to the Tyler okay. Perry chick, that's not how guns sound. Yellow flash, so she would know. <laughs> yeah. She's ghetto. Yeah, she's been around sniper. She lived in Harlem. In, the, in Harlem, yep, for sure. Tyrone had a bunch of them in his uh, bedroom. Like somebody said earlier, this is the same FBI that raided Mar-a-Lago. This is the same. They they got to do an investigation and be honest about it. Oh, come on. They're in Biden's back pocket or Obama's back pocket or someone else's back pocket. Oh, it's 1 a.m. I should dip out. I'll end up sitting here all night. Oh, well, if you got to go. Thanks for coming on. Yeah, thanks for having me and have fun and remember, question everything. And we don't really have any names. So hang tight, everybody. Yeah, When are we going to get that name? You'd think it would have came out by now because they have him. Yeah. They have him because they're scrubbing shit. Like you guys said, that's why. Because like you said, if this was an assassination attempt on Biden, they would have had shit ready to go. Oh, yeah. It would have been I thought they a released. mega loving gun freak well, uh, from Alabama. I'd also I would well, like see, to see. Uh, hold, hold on a second. I would like to see if this is true. Was this actually deleted? I have one job and that's to beat Donald Trump. So no, absolutely it's... certain. I'm the best person to be able to do that. So we're done talking about the debate. It's time to put yeah. Trump in a bullseye. No, I yeah. saw that, I, but I don't know if it's legit. It's CNN reporter on it. It is not real, according to the pending community note there, uh, that you can't see. But that, that's not a tweet by Joe team. Biden. That was a statement but he made to donors in a private correct. conversation. He made that yeah. statement, and someone put it into a, a tweet. Okay, but he did say that. He did. Yes. Yeah. I know he and said he, that. And, and they just pulled all their uh, campaign ads, too. For me, I'm going to go full conspiracy theory. The reason why Biden couldn't say anything and doesn't have an answer is because it was failed. If it succeeded, they already had their answer locked and loaded, ready to go in regards to Trump uh, Biden coming out and saying what he was going to say. But because it failed, he did like, oh, let me let me get my facts first. 
and that let me let me consult with my people so we can work out our story on why we failed to assassinate our political opponent. I know I probably I don't know if somebody that. shared it in the private chat. It was one of the million things I looked at today where basically you had a buttload of people from the media who were basically calling for like this is time to take to the streets. This is time to rise up. He's going after democracy. We got to stop Trump. Got to stop Trump. All this shit from the media and it's like and I, to me, somebody should take that video and cut it with the video of the people after the rally today yelling at the media going, this is your fault. Because it 100% is. This is the media's fault. And 100%. this is a sick. I just got into it with my old man yesterday over this shit because he was talking about, what is it called? Pact 2025 or whatever. Oh, Project and, 2025. Or Project, thank you. Yeah. And I'm like, that. I said, I don't, I wouldn't put much stock in that. And then, of course, today, Trump came out and denied even knowing what the fuck it was. And I said that to him. He's like, yeah, bullshit. And then this happens. And I said, well, what do you think is going to happen? I said, the media has done nothing but lie to you people for years. Because daddy, he'll always be like, well, where did you hear that? Where'd you see that? Where'd you hear that? I'm like, Twitter? I'm like, the actual video? Like, you know, like, he's like, oh, I didn't see that. I'm like, yeah, because all you watch is MSNBC and fucking CNN. Oh, I watch Fox News. I'm like, Fox News is almost as bad, too. They all get the same damn crap from the same damn sources. I would know because when I worked in radio, all this shit came from the same place. This is why when everybody was sharing that one video where everybody was like saying the same shit that one time, it's like, yeah, because they all get the yeah. same stuff. And you know, when I worked in radio, they told me you read it as the copy says it. You don't alter it. You don't change it. You don't add your editorial. You, nothing. You just read it as is. So you get this shit from the AP come down the line and they all get the same stuff. Right. So I'm not giving them an excuse, but I'm just telling you, this is what it's like. So that's why they're all saying the same shit all the damn time. They're finally starting to report that there's another person dead, other multiple outlets. I know I shared that earlier, but now another outlet has shared that, that there's a, a rally attendee got killed. So that's pretty much confirmed. Didn't they confirm Even that though, earlier today? Yeah, well, like there was a there woman was a, and then the guy that got there shot. There was the emergency head. room guy talking about fucking brain matter on the, like around the area where the guy got killed. So it's like, you know, thanks for finally con. Like, thanks for finally fucking confirming that mainstream media. Like, you know, they, they, they were so hesitant to, to jump on this because every one of them, I guarantee you, when that happened, they were all like, shit, we're fucked now. Yeah, you are fucked. Well, you know, if roles were reversed, the guy that shot would already would already have his full first and last name. His picture oh, yeah. would be everywhere. Everything about his entire life would be everywhere. If, well, I think uh, they're they're waiting though because they they don't they don't necessarily know this guy's background. If they if they if they find out that he's a hardcore leftist, and they're going to scrub and then release. If yeah. they find out, yep. you know, you know what he was. chance that he's not, you know, then then they'll put it out there and they'll leave everything up. So they're just they're trying to find out. But considering the amount of time that has passed, and they have the body, they have the identification, they know who he was. Uh, considering all the time that have has passed, that means they're scrubbing. If they didn't release it by now. And they have all the information already in terms of ID and body and everything. They're they're scrubbing. Mm -hmm. They're one hundred percent scrubbing. So it's you, it's going to come out. Don't worry. There's also probably that they're buying time because they're hoping that there will be a reaction from the right here. That somebody will do something stupid mm -hmm. and attack somebody or shoot somebody because that way the news cycle tomorrow will be about the the violent MAGA reaction. Exactly. Uh, we got this PA, the Pennsylvania police have made a statement. Before I go into that, though, I want to, I got to go, I got to go use the bathroom. So hold things down for a second. Don't right back. talk about Pokemon. Yeah. Please. So what's your favorite gym leader in Pokemon? Oh, God. God. Oh, God. I would say it's got to be Black Claire from Gen 2. Okay. I will say that. God, you guys are. That like. <laughs> 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 most of them uh most of the gym leaders and the elite four and everything like that are kind of like whatever for me but i gotta admit like lance lance is a total badass, oh, yeah, in the manga. badass I, don't, yeah. I don't know if you guys read the manga or whatever but like he literally tries to murder an entire city it's it's pretty crazy so like half the gym lance. leaders in the first game are evil in the manga like koga tries to poison them multiple times yeah yeah, Lance. You guys, do you guys uh, believe the the thing that like Giovanni is Ash's uh, dad? No, 
they, they kind of killed that rumor recently. But he's, too. Is, he's Silver's dad. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The redhead guy, yeah, yeah. So then it's he like you, you have to ask the question, like, how well, did that actually, happen? The, the original rumor was that his dad was Bruno, the uh, fighting guy from... I remember the, that. Yeah. Can, can you, you guys just fuck everybody? The Apple crazy, yeah. was this week? Hmm? Can you guys, I'm derailing you now. What? Can you guys believe how bad the acolyte was this week? I mean, it I wasn't any worse than what uh, the Generation Not 5 of Pokemon. I have no idea. <laughs> Somebody in the chat said Mr. Mr. Mime is Ash's dad, and that's really creepy. Mr. Mime is fucking his mom. The power of many. Scissor me timber sexy space which let's screw Trump needs to say that. Oh, yeah. That's a much <laughs> better song. Yeah. Trump needs to I'm merge bad. that somehow. We are the power of many. I was about to say, now with yellow flash away, I was going to take the opportunity to sneak away because it's now seven in the morning. So Oh, if you gotta go, thank man. you for having me. Yeah, thanks Dang. for coming on. It's always great That's to insane. have you. Arch. How do you stay awake so late? I have no Good idea. Good seeing you again, Arch. Because he's a he's a he's a beast. It's called tea and crackers. <laughs> nice meeting you all again, and uh, for the people I met for the first time as well. Have a good day, everyone. Nice, nice to meet you. Arch. Have a good nice day, man. You, your brother. Care. Bye. See ya. I don't know how he sees wake that late. No idea. All right, so now we can blame the British now that he's gone, right? Yep. Did you guys see <laughs> Destiny's tweets from we, earlier? Yeah, we talked about it. He's oh, talking about going to the gun range and how he yeah he's conflicted on all this shit. Oh yeah. stop, God, yeah, he's conflicted. Christ. He looks like the kind of guy that would pull the trigger of a gun and his and like he would like probably like let go of the gun because the kickback's too much. Or like if he pulls the trigger and he hits something that even looks remotely human, he cries about it. Oh god. I mean he's not and then films it for TikTok and Twitter. He's he's not wrong on one thing that you you should go practice. I mean, that is true. 